In today's video, we will be interviewing someone who is no longer with us, Bearded Brian. So Brian, tell us, why did you grow a beard? Well, while I was taking a photo every day for a year, I was growing out my hair. It was looking really cool, so I decided to grow out my beard as well, as much as I possibly could. And I haven't shaved since the 20th of July, 2022. Well, it was really cool to see it grow out, and it looked like it grew very quickly too. Yeah, it did. Was it very hard to maintain? No, for the first three months, I didn't even touch it. I only cleaned up the upper cheeks, and then I started cutting it with scissors. Wait, with scissors? Why not an actual trimmer? Well, I like to be very precise. I used the trimmer once, and and I ended up cutting it way too short. And was this the first time you had a beard? No, this is the second time. I had a beard with a different style in 2019. I just let that one grow wild during the summer without ever trimming it. And I never thought I'd be growing it out longer than I did that time. So I'm very surprised and also very happy that I grew this whole thing out. So what's the thing you love most about your beard? I think it makes me look better. I feel much more comfortable with a beard than without. Did you ever get bored of it? Never. Still right now, I wish I could keep it, but it's worth it. And did it ever disrupt your life? Like, how was it to take care of your skin? No, I never had issues with doing skincare. I believe my skin is actually doing better with a beard somehow. What was the most uh, annoying thing? Well, I told you what I hated most about my beard in the last things I hate video. So if you haven't seen that, go watch that. But the most annoying thing, I guess, was messing up when I was trimming it. For some reason, the longer it got, the easier it was to maintain. Do you have any advice for someone who wants to grow out their beard? Yes, do it. If you really feel that you want to grow it out, do it. Be very patient and make sure you take care of it. Of it. What reactions did people have to the beard? Well, some people loved it, but obviously some people didn't. I got told that it looks so dark, which surprised me too. I thought it would be thin, but it's actually quite thick. And if you look back a few years ago, you would never expect me to have this long beard. I'm honestly very surprised. Did people ever think you're older than you actually are? Yes. When I was 19, someone thought I was 24. Last year and this year, people thought I was either 26 or 27. But above all, I got told that I look 34. And this was very recent. It's just shocking how old the beard makes me. Did this type of issue ever want to make you shave it off? Nope, never. If I ever had a reason to shave off my beard, it had to be an important reason. And November is just that. I believe it sends a message. Why did he shave his beard off? Oh, it's for November. I told myself last year that if I still had the beard in 2023, I would shave it off and just have a mustache for the whole of November. And that's exactly what you're doing. Well, really it's what you're doing. Actually, I think it's enough questions for me. Uh, let me ask you some questions. What? No way, I'm interviewing you. No. No, 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 I'm doing this interview. Now exactly how do you feel without the beard? Well, I feel fine. I obviously miss it since I got used to just touching it whenever I'm thinking or waiting around, but I feel good. Do people know why you have a mustache? Yes. You see, years ago when I was a teenager trying to do this, I just said it was no shave November. I didn't really have the courage to go around just with a mustache, but now I'm confident enough. Why are you so confident? Well, people are more aware about Movember, so I don't really need to explain a lot. And also I'm not alone. There's so many men out there doing this with me, so I feel like we're all in this together. So what surprised you most when you shaved? I forgot how short my face was. Like the beard is so long that it just, it makes it so long. You know what I mean? So I kind of forgot how my face looked. Did your beard have any sentimental value to you? Of course, yes. It was something I had for the second half of 2022 and almost all of 2023. So of course I'm emotionally attached to it. So is this the first time you have a mustache? No, I once did this in 2021 and back then I loved it. But this time it's a proper and much much better mustache. I love it. And what would you say to someone thinking to shave their beard? Only do it if you're fully ready. I had to prepare myself in advance and I was ready to shave it even in September. And my last question to you, are you ever going to grow it back? Of course. And next time I do it, it'll be even better and much, much longer. together.